Hi guys, I just want to make a quick video concerning um, Comet Holmes or Blue Kachina. I hope he's made a prophecy about this Blue Star Kachina. This is not Bible prophecy, but it does line up with Bible prophecy because they talk about a blue star shining to mark like a warning for the seven years of tribulation, which is exactly like. Bible talks about seven year agreement, the tribulation period. Okay, it'll be cut short a little bit, but it is a time of tribulation. And then they say before a great purification of the earth. Well, the great purification of the earth that they're referring to is the return of Jesus Christ to rule the world for a thousand years with us, coming back with him. I made this slide, and actually, you can tell, which is good, you can tell it was 2016. I made this slide here, and I just added a little thing in the background about. Comet Holmes conjoining with the sun. Um, back in that year, it was the 19th of August. Um, but yeah, this whole thing blew up in 2007, I believe it was. And it was massive. It was big and blue. And it's a seven year orbit, pretty much, 6.9 something. And when they zoomed in on the comet, it's almost as if you can see an angelic being inside of it, isn't it? And it's flying through space and it blew up as a blue kachina. So if the blue kachina prophecy is true about the seven year agreement, uh, uh, around the time of the seven year agreement, it's going to be this comet, uh, Comet Holmes. So yeah, in this picture here back in 2016, it was making conjunction with the sun on the 19th of August. But um for some reason i had in my calendar my calendar um it was actually two weeks from now like 30th of something but so i don't know why but i've anyway come to look at it again comet homes and i've realized that hang on i've made a mistake there because it's actually the 17th of july which it makes conjunction see the i'm going back in time now and you can see the sun moving away 14th of july 15th, 16th, 17th is the closest, okay? And then it starts to move away again. And obviously during the, the days and the months and the weeks, it'll get further away from the sun. And that will make it actually easier to see if it does blow up as a symbol of the seven-year tribulation beginning. So 18th of August, you know, um, 18th of September it will move even further away and so it will make it easier for us to see it um, at dawn at dawn okay so so yeah I just want to do a quick video concerning this possible blue, blue Kachina star possibly marking the beginning of the seven year tribulation and it's literally just gone past the sun uh, two days ago which i missed because i thought it for some reason i didn't in my calendar of being the 30th so it's just past the sun now and it's moving further and further and further away and like i said it'll make it easier to see if it does blow up you'll see it in the dawn sky and pastor prophet justin roberts from under the age of Bible prophecy god bless you all Amen.